Hello guys, welcome back to Gutro Tips. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix driver error in Windows 11 and how you can fix this up. So let's get started. First thing what you have to do is just have to open this PC and you have to select lock it to C and right click on this and go to properties. From here you have to click on tools and go for check option and they will be asking to scan the drive you have to scan it up. And once it is been successfully done you have to follow my next instruction where we are going to do two steps. The first one sorry the second one is downloading the required drivers for the windows and the third one is all about we have to do some experiment on the CMD. What you have to do is just have to click over here and as you can see that I'll be providing this link in the description where you have to download all the drivers. Okay, So I'll be providing link in the description. As you can see that I have already downloaded. We just have to click over here. So this will be downloaded. Now you just have to open this. Okay which means we are going to do the installation process. Okay. Now from here you have to click on OK start installing. So which means the driver pack which we have downloaded right now is installing on a windows and once it is being successfully done, we have to do some commands. I mean we have to execute few commands in the CMD which I'll be giving you once here after so let's wait for this one so guys once after being successfully installing now we have to do a command on the cmd so i'm going to type cmd here and you have to go for run as administrator and what you have to do is just have to copy each these commands and you have to paste here in the cmd and you have to press enter uh, we have one more one around four commands you just have to copy these now you just have to paste these and uh, we have one more just copy these command and you have to paste this and we have sorry in the last we have a space scan now you have to paste this and once it is being successfully done what you have to do is just have to do a very normal restart and most probably the issue will be completely fixed and i hope this video is helpful for you guys and if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications see you soon in the next video peace out